Hey, gauges. And now the power went back down. Uh, it's staying. It's staying negative here. Bravo has cleared the runway for him. Twin Oaks, RV 317 Victor Alpha, taxiing from uh, fuel to uh, run up uh, runway 02, Twin Oaks. Over the airport. Parachutes over Melito. Alrighty. Uh, traffic. RV for Romeo Victor. Uh, Hangar Golf. Going to taxi. Zero two. Run up. Twin Oaks. to be Do you have audio recording on yours too? Yes. All right, that'll be good backup. It's the first time I've used this. Perfect. The first time I've used this uh, GoPro. Take some power out a little bit. We're going downhill. We don't need to go so fast. All right, everybody, welcome. This is Ted. You haven't met Ted yet, uh, but Ted's a sport pilot student uh, that I've been working with, and he's doing a great job, and we are getting uh, ready to go out and practice some pattern work, some takeoffs and landings in the RV-12 here. We might go up and do a little bit of air work first. We'll see how it's looking. Uh, it's got a little overcast layer, but we got some holes that we can get above it, so we'll see, uh, we'll see how that works out, and we're going to get ready for your departure here. Okay, flight instruments uh, is set for field, but we're below, so I'll probably take it back down a hair. Zero, five, one. Oh, that's too low. Okay. okay, all my databases. Fuel and board on this one is wrong, too. Niner 5, Niner Hotel Charlie, taking off runway 2, departing to the west, Twin Oaks. Okay, so engine gauge, gauges were still in the good. It's nice that we're warm. Uh, flight instruments. We're still in the good? Still in the good. What's the good? We're still in the green. Oh, okay. Green All the good. instruments are good. Yes, green yes. is good. Green, good. Okay. <laughs> uh, flight instruments. Okay, I got all those. Got this one that I usually forget about. 
brakes definitely work. Uh, flight control is free and correct. Uh, like that. Thank you. Come on, remote, connect to the uh, max on the tail, otherwise I'll be pissed. <laughs> Okay, flight controls, flight instruments, check and set. That's what I had done with the Garmin. Uh, eat this fuel quantity, we did that on both. My controls for just a second. Your controls are going to move us up here. Okay, and that one still shows, so that's good. Ah, that's uh, so not a problem with my headset here. I need to trim and flaps. Yeah, I can hear it screaming. Okay. Okay, trim and flaps are good. I've got the brakes. Can it be latched? In a oil temp, we are warm. Uh, in a good way. Uh, control stick full aft. Throttle. Going up to five, back down to four. And then we'll test lane B. Go to five. Back down to four. Lane B, watch for a drop, and a light, and back on, watch for the light, okay, lane A, off, we got the light, watch our RPMs, okay, back on, watch for the light, okay, back down, throttle, 2000. My, uh, yeah. And turn off traffic for around the other clear. Yeah, clear. Okay, a fuel pump one. Okay, got two on. So one off. Wait five seconds. The drop. Okay, we're good. Two. Watch for the drop. Okay, we're good. Both are back on. Fuses are good. Seat belts fastened and snug. Snug mine up there. Okay, takeoff briefing. Uh, working backward. Uh, we're gonna depart to the west. And well, we're out of the pattern. We'll uh, actually depart to the southeast to start with, okay. because that's where the clear sky is. There's no. Oh. Gotcha. Okay, so now starting at the beginning, uh, I'm gonna get lined up, uh, straight, ro ease on the throttle, right rudder. As we're coming up, if I should be rotating and, uh, well, wheel up and then rotate at 55. Oh, you're already rotated when the wheel's up. You're already in a rotation attitude. Fly at 55. Well, it flies when it's ready. Yeah. Okay, and my high-speed taxi there is my port point, throttle back, brakes. Otherwise, stay straight. Uh, 700 AGL is my is my turn, and other than that, I'm staying straight. My uh, uh, unexpected landing place is to the left. Yeah, and it's straight ahead and to the left. MSL will be uh, our turn. Usually 700 okay. AGL, but because of Hillsboro, we do it at 700 oh, MSL. Okay. Okay, so that's that, and otherwise we'll get into the pattern, and we'll have a we'll have a choice at that point. So yeah, we'll make a left downwind departure. So we'll stay at 1200 bef until we get past the airport, and then we'll continue a climb, and we'll depart to the southeast. Okay. 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 How are we looking for traffic? So you can just say that we're doing a left downwind departure to the southeast. Left downwind. Okay. Twin Oaks RV 317 Victor Alpha, taking runway 02, we will make a left uh, downwind departure to the southeast, Twin Oaks. I'll mess that up. All right, so get a track in the center line here first. Okay. 
And have that right rudder ready to go. Go, just get that nose up. There you go. Now we'll let off. Yep, there you go. Not too high, not too high. You don't want to hit my camera on the ground. Just right here. This is all you need to hold. Okay. Just right here. Just so the tire's off the ground. That's all we care about. Okay. There you go. Now pitch for 75. Pitching for 75. Staying straight. All around the runway. That's for 66589 or we're about five miles to the... What is the next radio call? Crosswind. Okay. Um, and, uh, yeah. We'll do crosswind. We could make a right crosswind, but we're not going to. I'll tell you why later. Okay. We'll make a left crosswind. I don't think we're going to get the tail camera today because it's not. Uh, yeah. Sucks. Twin of traffic, 317 Victor Alpha, turning left crosswind. Zero, zero two. Zero two. Clear of zero two, turning left crosswind, Twin Oaks. You have to say the runway. Again, that's not optional information. We've got two runways here. They have no idea which crosswind you're on, and that makes a big difference. Okay. All right, so level off at 1200 and turn downwind. We level off at 1200 here first because traffic that might be entering from the east over top of the field at 1700, uh, yeah. we don't want to climb up into them. So we stay in the traffic pattern until we are past the airport, and then we continue our climb, and we'll turn to the southeast. Turn over traffic, Cessna 720 is inbound, three miles to the east-northeast, looking for a left downwind runway, Joe 2, Twin Oaks. Traffic, Cessna 66589 we are two miles. All right, now I can continue to climb. Oh, wow, we've got to stay, you know, you won't be able to get much higher than 2,000 before we get out from under it, so head, okay. to, the, head to the east there. Short Bachelor. Hood. Bachelor. That's Mount Hood. Or, sorry, that's Mount Jefferson. That's Jefferson. Hood. Yeah. Sorry, yeah. Uh, yeah, Mount Hood, Mount Jefferson, Three Sisters, Adams, St. Helens, Rainier. Yeah. Taxi, zero two, Twin Oaks. Twin Oaks, area traffic, Grand Tech, area traffic. All right, got that traffic at 10 o'clock low. Yep. Yep. That traffic, that's the 4013 Juliet, holding short runway, three two for pattern work. You want, you want me to stop it too? No, I want you to keep going. Just okay. we have to clear the clouds here. So, yeah. Once you could have clouds climb up above them, we'll probably have to go up to uh, 4,500. Okay. So you can go ahead and bug that. Thanks for climbing to VY now. So we're clear oh, yeah. the clouds. Okay, bug 4-5. Going for 75. Short off traffic, Grand 6 3 Delta. Uh oh. Up wind for 0 2. Okay, I'm going to try. Standard Thanks. audio. Oh, what are you pushing? I'm uh, trying to figure out what the problem is with hearing the radio, and that was the one thing I looked up was removing the 3D audio. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, I mean, if you just turn the volume up here, it's pretty low. Usually we're between 60 and 70 percent as, as far as volume. All right, got that traffic above us. Traffic, 720, turn final, runway 02, 25. 75, come on, 75. Now, once we get above these clouds, 
We'll turn to the south. Too bad, this is not going to work, I don't think, because it wouldn't connect before. Uh, and now I can't get it to connect at all, it just sucks. Yeah. And it's just hanging out in the wind. Yeah. Okay, that's a thousand to go. Milano Chef, a car B5 off Delta on the base, 3-2 Milano. Traffic, that's 66589er, left downwind, 0220. Alright, so yeah, go ahead and turn to the south now. Okay, south it is. 75 and bug it. And 4100 to 45. Studios clear of. And we can't stay at 5,000 longer than five minutes, so even if you're still climbing, bring it down, down below 5,000. And so up traffic, uh, RV4, road music, dear. Uh, Go ahead and switch over to practice area frequency. Okay, which is 12275. Yep. We got it all reloaded for me. Okay. All right, I just got to keep an eye on that traffic we have at our same altitude at 1 o'clock. That seven like he's coming across me. Oh, he's facing more or less the same direction we are. Oh, but. Looks like there is going to six five eight one three five miles to the south of St. Paul, descending through four thousand seven hundred feet down to twenty five hundred. We uh, departed an area to make them. Oh, I got high. This my power a little bit. Forty five. And for collision avoidance, I like to have the landing line on pulse. I only really like it on steady when we are actually flying at night and okay. need it for landing. Go ahead and just push it down. All right, so they are still out in front of us. Like they're, they're descending over there. 12 o'clock low, yeah. Not that low. Okay, so go ahead and do your pre-maneuver checklist. Uh, trying to remember what's on the checklist besides my clearing turns. Oh, what's the acronym we use? Too many acronyms. Welcome to flying. <laughs> Welcome to aviation. Yes. Shell, um, like a seashell. So is that my, uh, here, I need your help. All right, so switches and seatbelts, right? S is okay. like, in every single acronym, it's for it's like flight, positive switches. Yeah. Thing, like S is always switches and seatbelts. Okay. Uh, so switches and seatbelts. Our lights are on, our seatbelts are on, we're good. Okay, H. Right above ground. Okay, what's which the, what's we want to end at 15. Oh well, yeah, we need to make sure we're at least. Yeah. 1500 what? Uh, above the ground, so AGL. Yes, A above the ground, yeah. yeah. Okay, and we are, we're at 4,500, which is basically 4,300 AGL. Yeah. Okay, E. Uh, it's E my engine. Yeah, engine configuration in this plane, we really don't have to do much. It's, right. it's taken care of, but we obviously make sure our fuel's on, our, our pumps are on, and that's all good. 
L, first L. Uh, all I can think for L is lights. Landing spots available. Landing okay. areas. So we've got lots of landing areas available right now. Wind is yes. out of the north, so ideally we would land to the north, but it's fairly calm, so we won't worry too much about it. Okay. But uh, we need to know what landing areas are available. There's also Sportsman Field behind us. Um, okay. Aurora off to our left. And so, and then last L is Lookout. So Lookout, we're going to do our clearing turns. Guys, 300 feet below us, okay. Yep. So we're going to do our clearing turns. We usually would do them to the left, left, but since that guy's to the left already, we see him, we're going to go to the right. Okay, and that 90 right, and then 90 left again. And actually, we're just going to do a whole 180 degree turn okay. to the right. Looking outside, and in addition to our clearing turn, our our other look at part of lookout is making a call, lookout call out. So you're on West Practice Area frequency. And, uh, is which, it just called West Practice Area? Yeah. So what you're going to say is uh, West Practice, West Practice area, RV3 and San Victor Alpha, 4,500 over St. Paul, maneuvering West Practice. 200 northbound, descending 1,200 West Practice. West Practice. RV 317 Victor Alpha, 4,500 over St. Paul, maneuvering west of practice. Perfect. All right, good. So, yeah, keep the turn coming in. Yep. All right, that guy is a little bit more to our north, northeast. I see him a little bit below us, so he shouldn't be a factor. We're going to try to kind of stay over St. Paul here okay. for the most part. There's another guy behind us, 500 feet below, so stay on this heading for now. Okay. All right. West practice area, says 48286, five miles Go ahead to the south of Forest Grove, and um, slow flight westbound, west practice at 2000. Go ahead and get us into slow flight. All right. On this heading of north, so bug your heading okay. so that you don't lose track of it. Yep. All right, and I want you to get us in slow flight in the landing configuration. Landing configuration. So that's going to be full flaps, but not obviously not yet. But yep. Okay. So but I'm going to reduce power yep. and make sure we hold altitude of 4,500. Yes. And my rudder is going to go to the left a bit because of that. In the white, I'm going to stay level and then think about flaps. Trim and now flaps. Okay, there's half flaps and 62. I'm add some power. And I got eyes on that traffic out 12 o'clock. Thank you. Okay, and now I'm going to go full flaps, trim it, a little bit more right rudder. Uh, this is going to hit the... Air speed. Yeah, it's hitting the... There we go. Thank you. Yeah. Traffic system 54904 Papa 1400 over Gaston northbound to Forest Grove West practice. West practice air traffic Skyhawk 74 Kilo forms is on the southwest side of Woodburn now 5000 feet northwest down stall for practice. Okay, I'm going to give you a little bit more power. Once you're established here, go ahead and keep us at this speed and altitude and turn us to the right back to back to south. I'm... Go. Oh, I'm trying to just stay right there. Okay, so you want me to turn 180 south? Yep, to the right. Okay. Maintaining this speed and altitude. Altitude. And a great turn is shallower. Yep, much shallower. Speed. That's all you need. Coordination.
Just left the area, just now 531 at the max, 2.5 miles of Max Member North, 4,000 feet. Actually, go ahead and level us off at Point Mount Jefferson. Okay. All the wings. There it is. There we go. There we go, all the way over. Okay, you should have it hands off, yeah. Okay, good. And then you can just use the rudder. So if you have the pants off, use the rudder to keep the wings level. So if this wing starts to drop, push the left rudder. Left rudder. And there you go. Just use the rudder to keep those wings level. Heading south down 2,500. All right. Good. So from here, I want you to uh, establish us in a descent at 60 and then perform a power off stall okay. towards Mount Jefferson. At uh, like 4200, we'll consider the runway? Uh, 4400. 44, okay. Yep. Traffic, just a 5-4 diner for Papa's over Forest Grove, 1500. Headed back east to Hillsboro, last call. Okay, turn us a little bit more. We're going to do uh, one, two, zero. well, just right at Mount Jefferson. So a little bit more to the right. There we go. Now we're pointed at Mount Jefferson. Okay, so this heading, there's your bug, right at Mount Jefferson. I'm going to 4-5? Four, 4-4. Four, four. Four, four. Four, four. Okay. Yep. So you first you just need to establish okay, the so descent. Establish my descent. Yep, so you can pull a little bit of power out, just a little bit. And yep, and there you're already at 60, so hold 60 there. But yep. pull some power out so you get the descent going. Yep. There you go, 60. Pull there more power, 60. get the descent going. We have to pull the power out to get more descent. Okay, and power off stall. Take it to the full, to the first physical indication okay. of the stall. And there's 40, there's 20. Still at 60, okay, there we go. The power needs to come to idle, right? Power yeah, to idle, all the way back. Okay. Yep, rudder control, right. maintain the coordination. Right. Holding that nose right on Mount Jefferson. Keep pulling back, keep pulling back, holding that nose. There we go. Yeah. Why are you driving us into the ground? We just lost 200 feet from our runway. We are dead. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> so I, I need to... To climb us back down first more. right now, yeah. So, my controls for a second. Your controls. And you didn't bring flaps up. You gotta bring flaps up. Okay. All right, we're gonna turn this way. So again, remember, we are per demonstrating a approach to landing stall, which means that we are very close to the ground, if not right over it. We have found that we have grossly mistaken our airspeed and altitude and we are now stalling and about to fall to Earth. And we need to recover and get away from that as quickly as possible. Okay, that's the scenario that we're simulating. So what needs to happen is as soon as you realize the stall is happening, which in this case, usually it would be the stall horn in real life, if not, yeah. if not something else sooner. But in this case, I'm telling you to take it to the first physical indication, which in this plane tends to be buffeting. Yeah. And very sloppy controls. Okay. So the first thing, as soon as you realize that, you need to first acknowledge it verbally. Acknowledge it verbally so that I and the examiner know that you're not just arbitrarily deciding, okay, this is gotcha. enough, but you are acknowledging the signs of the stall. Yeah. Okay. And then you need to immediately recover with by letting off back pressure, letting the nose down, not pushing it down, but letting it down, and adding full power, bringing that nose immediately to level so that we're not descending, right? Yeah. Okay, because it's power up, speed up. Once we speed up, we pitch up, and then clean up with the rest of the flaps. Okay. The flaps need to come in incrementally, so part of the right. speed up, when we go level, Flaps come up to half, and you're not looking down here. 
or half exactly. We don't care right. if it's exactly half. We're just doing one second of click. Yeah. One second on, one second off. Okay, so let me just demonstrate it real quick. Slowing the airplane down. This is the heading we're going to be on. Okay, now I need to get back up to... No, this is fine. Okay, I'm going to bring my flaps in. I'm establishing a descent at 60. And I'm trimming for 60, so that's the other thing. You're going to have to fight the trim when you go around with that power because it's going to be trimmed for 60. Yeah. All right, 4300, there's my runway. Power to idle, and I'm just holding this at 4300. Holding this, holding this, holding this. Okay, keeping rudder coordination. Rudder coordination, sloppy controls, there's the buffet. Full power, nose down, nose to the horizon, flaps up to half. Accelerate, get up to at least 60, then pitch up, and then clean up by putting the rest of the flaps out. Gotcha. Okay, holding forward and trimming for the uh, proper climb. Yeah. At at least 60, if not uh, 60 initially, because that's VX. Yeah. And then 75 ultimately. Okay, so as soon as you let off that back pressure and let that nose fall, full power comes in with it, and yeah. then the nose comes to level with half laps. Okay. Okay. All right. And see where we're at here. All right, we're going to turn this around. Back towards our mountain, so you have a nice visual reference to look at. Also nice not to be headed south and face into the sun. Yep. All right. Now we're pointing at Mount Jefferson. Now we're trimmed. All right, your controls. My controls. Go ahead and slow us down and then get us established in that descent. Sure. As long as you maintain 4,500, like you should, then we'll call 4,300 our runway, okay? Okay. Okay, so I am in the white and so I'm going half flaps. Yeah, white arc. Don't say I'm in the white. That sounds racist. Somehow. Racist, yeah. Okay. Uh, West practice area, RV3 on 7 Victor Alpha is uh, two miles northeast of St. Paul. 4,500 power off stalls. West practice. West practice, sure. I've been charged 54 uniform just on the uh, southeast side of St. Paul. A bit 5,800, and we're doing uh, stalls eastbound. West practice. You, you see them, I assume? I see them on the screen. I don't see them in person yet. Okay. okay, pitching at 60, let's see, I do have yep. a descent. You're holding that mountain Good. right where yep. it is. Yep. There's your heading bug, there's your mountain. Yep. Okay, descending. Pull a little more power as I descend. 44, I'm going All right, let's call this your runway right here, 360. Okay, here's your runway. Okay, level off. Oh, three, that's 360. Okay, yeah. power to idle. Power to idle, pitching up. Still waiting for the buffet. There it is. Okay. All right. And half flaps. Hey. Okay. Going too fast there anyway. Full flaps. As I climb. So I didn't I didn't climb in time. Also didn't have enough rudder. Yeah, you still don't have enough rudder. Go ahead and get that in there. There we go. Alright. Do it again. Just going to get us established in that descent. Yep. It wasn't, it was better, much better, okay? But it wasn't, it was still not deliberate enough. And you okay. did, and you actually recovered a little bit early. Okay, you you keep going forward and back like this. This should be like being held back by the time it's stalled. Like, you should held back. You shouldn't okay. be letting it. And then when you recover, that's when you let it forward. Okay, so I kind of softened it? Yeah, you just kind of recovered earlier than you needed to. Okay. All right, but maintain altitude, okay? So 4,500 will be our runway. So establish a descent okay. here. Power out. Get the descent okay, going. Get full flaps in there. And flaps. And then trim for 60. Okay, there's 60. I'm going to 4.5. No, 
20. I'm going to pull full power. Pitch, 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 pitch. Power out, dial, yep. Okay, so, so just hold it here. Okay, there's my sign. No, 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 stop, stop, stop. My controls, okay. my controls. I didn't feel anything there. <laughs> okay. Fuck it. Power at idle. Holding it here. Holding coordination. Holding altitude. Okay. Holding it, holding it, holding it, holding it. That's the button. You feel that? That's the button. That's the button. Full power, right rudder. Nose to the horizon. Flaps up high Flaps. half. I'm still accelerating. 60. Now pitch up and clean up the rest of the flaps. Gotcha. Okay. All right. Let's. Um. Uh, yeah, that's good. Just stay on this heading. Do it again. Okay. Okay. Your controls. My controls. Your controls. Okay. So we want to feel the buff. I want you to acknowledge by saying, not just there it is, because we what what what's there. <laughs> there so. Yeah. I want you to acknowledge every sign. So first acknowledge okay. the stall horn, acknowledge sloppy controls, then acknowledge okay. the buffet, and then say recover. Okay. We want to be able to see every every point at the, of the stall occurring. Okay, there's half flaps. Pitching for 60. That's not 60 there, or 60. Okay, and full flaps. Power, power back in. 4,400 will be our run. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Salvage factory. 859 Juliet Tango over Mason Lake. There it is. Yeah. Power to idle. Power to idle. That's just like we're landing. So power to idle. Hold that. Pitch it. Pitch Don't let the oh, nose sorry, swing. There, there you go. Don't yeah. let the nose swing. Just hold it still. Okay. Keep pulling back. Keep pulling back. There's the bounce. Okay. Pitch up to the horizon. Come on. You don't. We're not diving at the ground. We're accelerating this way. Flaps need to be up right now to half. That's half. Okay. Accelerate. Now pitch up. Pitch up and then full flaps at this yeah. point. Okay. A bit more right rudder. So how's the song Trip. go? Remember the song I taught you? Pitch and power up speed. Power up speed up. Pitch up clean up. Okay. So power up. Speed up at the horizon half flaps up. Okay, the half flaps gets rid of the drag. Yeah. Don't climb that square at 4,500. So we get rid of the drag. That's our speed up. Once we hit 60, we pitch up. And then once we establish that positive rate of climb, we clean up the rest of the way. Get the okay. flaps up all the way. Okay, it has to happen that way. And you're still not taking the stall like all the way. Like It should be, literally, you shouldn't have any more room to pull the okay. stick back and you're still just letting it you're still recovering early okay okay so you've climbed up 200 feet so 4500 will be our our runway okay do it, do it again yep and remember that we're simulating coming into land so as soon as you level off and in this case 4500 that power needs to come to idle power, just like yep. like you would uh, over the runway okay so there's full flaps and I got way slow. Yeah, I was descent. Yeah, power out. Power back. There we go. Okay, I am descending. I'm going to 45. Yep, XD. Let's, let, let's call it 46 at this point. Okay. okay, I'm staying at 60. Going to 46. There we are. So there's power. There's hold the nose still. Up. Don't let it. Don't let it swing. Don't let it bounce. Just hold it still. Hold okay. it still. Nar. Hold it still. Hold the nose still. Hold okay. the nose. Still. <laughs> Keep pulling back. There. That was the there. Oh. Now recover. Recover. Okay. Power up. Speed up. Yep. Pitch up. Back at the mount. Okay. Pitch up. Pitch up. Come on. Pitch up. You, you, you dived at the ground again, so you gained a lot of airspeed really fast. Okay. You gotta just down and up. It's like literally just breaking the angle of attack. The crit oh, sorry. Sorry, guys. Don't mean to be in your face. It's literally breaking the critical angle of attack as you add full power and then straight up to the horizon so that you're just flying straight. Just think, let go and level off here. 
Again, you're, you're, we'll call it 50 feet above the runway. You're not going to just dive down at the runway and keep going that direction. You're yeah. going to get the nose up as soon as you can it's for level flight. Yeah. Okay. So that's what we need to do, but, okay. Uh, hey, one more. So I'll do one more then. <laughs> okay. But only if you do it absolutely correct. Oh, I'm just going for slightly better. All right, I'll take that. I'm going to go to 46. Okay. Pitch to 60. There we are. I want you to acknowledge every sign. Okay. Okay, so I'm coming into land. I'm pitching. I'm pulling power back. There you go. Now just hold that nose still. Doesn't have to Here's the start of the warning. I'm pulling back. There it is. There it is. Forward. Pull on. Pull power. Nose to the horizon. Pull power. Nose to the horizon. Come on. Yeah, you dive straight down to the ground. So let me demo I'm one more. I'm trying to break it. it. I'm getting too much speed because yeah. of that. I'll just demo one more here, but it's, you're just you're just diving at the ground. You don't need to be doing that. Yeah. Okay, so. Well, acknowledge the signs. As soon as you feel that break, though, that's when you you know you let it forward, but only enough, just just you know, no more than 10 degrees down, uh, and just enough to break that critical angle, and then it's straight to the horizon. All right, flaps coming in. I'll right, we'll just descend to 4,400 at 60 here. Trim for 60. Uh, say 4450 here and watch watch my nose watch how I don't let it move around and bounce around okay hard idle coming up look at my nose isn't moving okay yeah that's what we want just proper coordination nose isn't moving nose isn't moving nose isn't moving okay sloppy controls there's the buffet there's Go the break back. full power straight to the horizon accelerate now with right rudder Level. 60 yeah. and half laps now pitch up Positive rate of climb, clean up the rest of the flaps, yeah. and then adjust the trim. Okay, and then climb back out at 75, all right? Okay. So, we'll work on those more. Yeah. Because uh, you're at the point now of diminishing returns. Yeah. <laughs> right. So, but those are the key things that I need you to just think about and when you're at home, yeah. and chair flying. Number one, nose stays still. It's not bouncing all over the place. And when you watch this video back, you'll see yeah. Uh, and number two, um, you're just literally bringing, letting the nose down enough to break the critical angle of attack while you add full power, and it's straight to the horizon. You're not holding it down at the ground. It's just breaking critical angle attack to the horizon. Just whoop, to the horizon. All right. All right. Uh, your controls. My controls. Your controls. And you just lost your engine. Oh, I lost my engine. So this is my... A, B, C, D, E, but I'm going to aviate, and I'm going to uh, pitch for best glide. I'm going to look for somewhere to land. Okay, what is best glide? My best glide is 63. Okay, so yeah, A is airspeed. Yep. Okay, so pitch and trim. So there's 63. Let me trim for it. Trim it out. Okay. Come on, back to 63. There we go. Okay. I see a nice big field, and there's a pond with the white houses there. Um, I uh, like, let's see, I want to head okay, so north. Which, which, I mean, yeah, it's like a big, big field, but. Yeah, see where the, okay. where the yeah. square pond is? Yeah, okay. So that field, I'm going to head north for it. So are you landing before the pond and the big field the closest to us? Yeah, diagonal okay. on it. Let's try to stay away from houses, though, so. Yeah. Pick something a little different that's just not close. I mean, usually, you know, you'd want to land near a house or something. Like yeah. Your airspeed, come on. Yep. Uh, but in this case, okay. we want to try to stay away from sure. houses and stuff. So just turn around a little bit. Take this, uh, let's see, there's a big brown field there. What else do I have? What's my speed? There's my speed. Yeah, just kind of like I have plenty of fields, you. but where? And you got power more? lines. You see power lines there that are all going that direction. So you want yes. to be aware of those power lines. Okay. okay. Oh yeah. Look at this nice big uh, uh, pasture. That's a good one. Which one? Uh, with the huge barns here. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so, all right. right. How about this? How about you see the brown field that's a little bit off uh, about 11 o'clock? 
that looks like a long runway type field. Just that brown field that's right there off, off of the clock. Going east-west? Uh, yeah, more or less. Yeah, that one. But let's use that one. Okay. Okay. All right, so you're going to maneuver us toward that. Okay. Okay, so... Right, so be your best place some, to land. Okay, we found yeah. our best place to land. So I have some elevation so I can check my checklist, which I thought I was keeping handy uh, for Just press menu twice. Menu twice. Checklist, and then Checklist. hit emergency at the yeah. top. I'm watching See? my speed, too. Yeah. Well, if you trim for it, you shouldn't need to watch it. Okay. So trim properly. Okay. So there's my best glide. It's still wanting to accelerate, so you need to trim. Okay. Go. How's my fuel valve? It's on. My EMS backup battery. You would I would turn, turn on. on. Yep. Uh, lanes A and B, they're on and they're red, or they're not yep. red. Throttle, I would set. Crank, like it's far pin override. Yeah, you'd only crank to. it if the engine wasn't spinning. Yeah. I uh, fails to start, so I've got my best glide, and I knew my best sync was a little slower than that. All right, anyway. so it fails to start, we can't do anything. So yeah. D. Uh, declare. Okay. I'm going to go 7700. I'm going to use my channel or 121.5. Um, uh, probably I'd, I'd use uh, the, the Unicom. Uh, well, you'd use somebody, you want to talk to somebody I, who can you send help. You want ATC. So 118.1 yeah. if you're here for Portland or yeah. or 121.5. Yep. Okay. Okay. Uh, so I've declared. Yep. E. Uh, e, depending on which version of the checklist you use, E is execute. Which for me is. Uh, That's not what we use though. That's not what I use. Your, yours has, a, has more. Yeah, I don't remember it, what it does. Yeah. E is ELT. Okay, okay, we turn our ELT on. Okay. That should have been, yeah. Okay, so then F, uh, e, uh, EF. Uh, final field. Oh, forced landing procedures. Forced landing, yeah. So, forced landing procedures include things like we crack this open. Yep. Make sure it's unlatched. We secure everything. We turn the fuel off, right? We turn the lanes off. Yep. Uh, we would save the master switch until right before touchdown, but ultimately we'd be turning the master switch off. Okay, we want to reduce the chance of fire. Um, and we'd get anything soft if we have coats or anything to put in front of us. Yeah. Okay, so force landing procedure. And then G. The ground. Get it on the ground. Okay, so that's what we're doing. Keep track of your field. Where's your field? I was going for this one right here. All right, whichever one you're going for. Yeah. I don't know if that's the one I looked at, but either way, that's fine. Just choose whichever one you're going for. Yeah. And you want to set us up so that we can set down in it safely. Okay. All right, so basically you want to maneuver yourself to the point where you're on a downwind leg. Uh, yeah. And we're almost at traffic pattern altitude, 1,200 right. feet. Okay, so you want to maneuver to a downwind type leg so that you could basically just fly a normal pattern. Yeah. I don't know if I ha if I left enough room to to uh, do a pattern into that one. Well, maneuver now to so that you where where is your field? I can't see it. It's uh, it's this one right here. Ahead of us? Yes. Okay. Well, which we don't have enough to get to. Right. To, so to do a pattern to. Well, yeah. I mean, so that was bad planning on your part. <laughs> I don't, that wasn't the field I chose to begin with yeah. anyway. But at this point, if that was your field, and that's that's not the field you want to be in. That's actually a crop. That's not flat. Terrain yeah. You see that? That's a, a planted crop. So you wouldn't want to land okay. in that. You'd want to land in the green. Caution. Terrain okay. ahead. So at this point, if it was a real emergency, you need to maintain your airspeed. Stop. Stop. What are you doing? What are you doing? Maintain your airspeed. Okay. okay. And you'd go to whatever field we find. The, the, okay. The go ahead and go around. Okay. Flaps are up. Okay. Right rudder, come on. There you go. All right, so we need to do a better job on the B, the best landing place. You need to choose one, and then make sure you set yourself up properly to land in that field. Okay. All right, we didn't really, um, didn't really get a good field there, and, and the one that you were aiming for, like I said, that's a planted crop. You don't want yeah. to land in that. So, um, but everything else is good. Okay. Yeah, key thing, making sure that you get that airspeed trimmed out immediately while you... Oh, uh, so I'm not fighting it. Right. While you're looking for that best place to land. Once yeah. you choose the best place to land, you want to stick with it and you want to make sure you're maneuvering appropriately while you do your other things. 
right? Your checklists and all your other things. While you do those th other things, you can't lose track of where you're landing. Because out here we have tons of options. We can, you know, if you press one field, whatever, you just go to the right. next one. But that might, that's not necessarily all the, always the case. When yeah. you're out in the mountains or whatever, there might be only, only one, one spot to land. Yeah. And if you lose track of it and get blown away from it, there's no getting back. Right. So you need to pick it, you need to stick with it, and you need to maneuver properly so that you can get to it. Okay. All right? Um, yeah, but everything else is good. Checklist, the declare, the ELT. Yeah. The forced landing procedures is essentially what you were trying to do with E and execute. Okay, but forced landing procedures, making sure that we get everything secured with the engine, with the electronics, get the uh, door open, yeah. and uh, prepare for any impact. And then D, getting it on the ground. And assuming you do all of that correctly and safely and you succeed, you get to move on to H, which is hospital. Find, find in a hotel for the night. hotel. All right. Yes. All right. Good. Uh, we're gonna go to Molino. Okay. And it figures. Let's level us off here. Okay. And go ahead and take us over towards Molino. Now, on fourth flight, we have these yellow circles. What are these yellow circles around? Uh, yellow circles are the planes. If it's open, it's uh, not a, a threat. And I see the one off my... These yellow circles Oh, you said here. yellow circle. I was thinking uh, those. Level off. Oh, the, level, the off. level off. Stop climbing. You can see my traffic. Yep, I see it. Okay. Good. Yeah, so what are the yellow circles? What yellow circles are you talking about? Yeah, why haven't you leveled off yet? I don't have that one that you have. No, level off first. Forget about that. Aviate, navigate, communicate, right? Yeah. <laughs> so level off. Get that taken care of. Okay. All right, go ahead and turn us to a heading of 040. Okay. Eight nine two two six two nine south of banks one thousand three hundred heading forest group west practice. And driving that's again. Uh. Uh. setting we have to do. You should have it there. I don't know why it's not showing. It must be just in other settings. So, anyway, I'll take that. that is that the, the glide radius? No. These yellow circles here that are around. Oh. Uh, that, I believe, is like the TFR? Nope. Parachuting operations. Ah. Okay. So, on a day like today, they do have jumpers. Yeah. They jump out of Malala up here, and they jump out of Malino. So Malino, they stay to the north end of the field, but we need to be aware of that and listen on the radio. So their yeah. frequency is the same as Twin Oaks, so go ahead and switch over. Uh, and since it's CTAF, I should be making a call in. Yeah. Yeah, uh, and yeah, they don't have weather, but winds are out of the north, uh, so you know, let them know that we are about six miles to the south, inbound 3-2. Three 3-2, two. Three two. okay. The line of traffic, this is RV 317 Victor Alpha, seven miles to the south, inbound for runway 3-2, the line of traffic. Okay, good. Just keep this is out of there, and keep four out of there. Everything else is good. Yeah. I I set this for my heading. So oh, good. All right. Yeah, there's Malaya or uh, there's Malala down there. Yeah. So I don't know. be keeping our eyes out for any parachutes, you know, because we're on frequency and they'll they'll call from Malino here. Yeah. They won't call on this frequency for Malala though. So we need to be aware of uh, oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah, with all the uh, parachute operations. That's 
we're right over. That's Malala right there. Yeah. Or this is where they'd be, so. Keep your eyes out. I don't see any plane up there, so. is four miles to the east looking for traffic. All right, so how are you going to enter the pattern here for all I know? The 3-2 is basically north. I'm going to up to the, and I believe it's a left. Is it a left? Well, how would you using, know? Well, I'm using you as my external brain for that. Um, but check it. Here, yeah. There we go. Okay, runway. Right traffic. Okay, right so. Right traffic for what? Oh, only for 1-4. Okay, so it is left traffic on 3-2. Okay. So I'm going to be staying to the west of it, and I'm going to enter on a teardrop. So I'm basically going to pass it and come back. And you're not going to teardrop. You're just going to extend. Well, yeah. And then come in on a 45. Yeah. Okay. Is that it? Yep. Okay. Okay, so start descending, because uh, what's traffic pattern altitude here? Traffic pattern is, I'm guessing, about 12, but... The downwind for zero two, twin oaks. What is it? Yeah, uh, twelve sixty. It says. Yeah, so thirteen hundred. Yeah. Okay. okay. So start that descent down, so it gets yes. down to uh, thirteen hundred, and then you can make another call here. Just letting them know we're four miles to the south. We'll be make, uh, entering forty five left downwind three two. Lino 317 Victor Alpha, four miles to the southwest, entering left pattern for 32. Uh, th uh, the Lino traffic. Yeah, specifically you want to know yeah. that we're entering the 45 for the left downwind. That's where we will be. Yeah. Okay, now you, what else do we need to be careful out here for airspace wise while we're maneuvering to enter the pattern? Well, Aurora. Right. Okay, so you should not get that close, but you need to be aware oh, that it's right it. over there. I see it there. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And now's a good time to do your at least your initial right. pre landing but, checklist. Yeah. My brakes undercarriage is still in place. Gas, one, two, three. Uh, switches. And lights. Yeah, pulse. The, yeah, strobes on. Strobe. Okay. Uh, switches, seatbelts. Your strobes okay. actually need to be on. Uh, those are your anti collision lights, so they need to be on all the time. Okay. go just up over past here and turn and yep. I have a thousand feet I need to lose still. Yep. So I'm gonna pull some more power. You're entering the 45 for the left downwind. 3 2. The Lino 317 Victor Alpha entering uh, 45. downwind for left 45. 45 three, left downwind, 3 2. 45 left downwind, 3 2. Lino. The Lino. That's all you got to say. 45 left downwind, 3 2. Okay, get down. You should be at traffic pattern altitude already when we're on this 45. You need to be okay. already down there. So pull that power out. Get down. Make this a full stop taxi back. Full stop. Okay. So when they have jumpers here, they land in that field on the north end. Kind of where that pond okay. is? Uh, not quite, but yeah. Okay. Uh, there, so anyway, just be aware of that. Okay. Okay, now you're below traffic below. pattern, so uh, fix that. Yep. 
Okay, keep uh, talking. Quite a bit below. Keep talking. Okay. Uh, up Come on, fix your altitude. Fix it. Add that power in. Get back up there. Don't be shy at the power because you're going to start stalling. So okay. if you're going to climb, get the power in there. Okay. okay. If you just keep pitching up, you're just going to slow down and stall. All right, now you're there. Now pull it back. Make a call that you're left downwind. Okay. Malino 317 Victor Alpha, left downwind 32 Malino. Good, just that's all it takes. Okay, we're at BMR point. Start your descent. Starting my descent. So power back. Power goes back. Once I'm in the white, I'm gonna go half flaps. Yep. Power back more. Just pitch forward. Power to idle. There yeah. you go. Good. Okay, I'm pitching for that. Okay, half okay. flaps, good. 70 yep. right. Yep. 70 on downwind. 70 here, 65 once I turn the corner. Yep. Okay. Uh, that's not 70. Come on, I want 70. There we go. Uh, Make your base call. Well, I know 317 Victor Alpha turning base. Uh, 32, Milano. Yeah, just left base, 32. Okay. Gotta say okay. left, otherwise, they don't know if you're just some okay. crazy guy. <laughs> Off okay. on the right. Pulling full flaps. Pitching. 500. Okay. Stand at 65. I'm gonna add some power because I feel low with these trees. Yeah, you're not low. You're good, Turn. but but okay. adding power is a good thing because it's gonna keep okay. you where you are, right? You don't want to get lower. Yeah. You want to maintain. So that's exactly what you do. You use that power to control your glide slope, and you're yeah. doing fine. So yep. Now pitch for 60. So you Milano three and seven Victor Alpha. Uh, final final three two uh, Milano. There you go. Good. Pitch for 60 now. Okay. Pitch for. That's what I forgot. Yeah. There you go, 60, and just use the power to control your your approach to those numbers. Okay, so add a little power, nose down because you're slow. Okay. Add some power. Go. Get us on that center line. Okay, let it keep coming down, keep coming down. Good. Now, okay. let it come down. Good. Get down and then right. I'm gonna now go. round out, power to idle. Power Just to fly it level, fly it level. There you go. Now hold that back. Careful with the nose. We don't want it to okay. slam down like yeah. that. Okay, and you'll get us off here. Yep. Okay. Not get bad, not bad. Up. Okay, good start, good start. Yeah. Off the runway. Come on, get us over there. There you go. All right, come to a stop. Pull that power back, come to a stop. Clean up the airplane. Make sure it's idling at 1800 or above. There you go. Whoa, 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 Take it easy. Take a breath. There we go, yeah. Stay in my controls. Your controls. Okay. Okay. So you gotta take a breath. You did, you're, doing, yeah. you're doing great. Okay, everything you're doing is great. That was a great landing. Everything was good, your radio calls are good. Okay? Mm -hmm. But you're stressing yourself out. Yes. Even though you're doing great. So you need to take a breath. Make sure you slow down here. Okay? Because even when I just said bring it up to 1800, you're just like, ah! Yeah. Okay? So, yeah. take it easy. All right. Okay. Um, Bops and trim just a hair. Okay. And real quickly, we... Like a quick stop so I can get this stupid tail cam working. <laughs> oh, there's a 195 there too, okay. Cool. Which is that? That blue one right there. Oh. All right, every time you're taxiing here and like parking, you need to be careful of chains. Yeah. You don't want them getting sucked up. You don't, ideally, you don't want to run over them with your tires either. So you kind of need to maneuver so that you don't run over anything sharp or... Yeah. These are really bad. Like, these are like sticking up and crazy yeah. like. Okay. So real quickly,
That's on. Okay, there we go. Alright, here, let me just taxi us out of here real quickly. Uh, you are or I am? I will. Okay. Alright, good. We got the tail cam working now, guys, hopefully. So let's go ahead and get out to the runway. We'll do a few laps in the pattern while we have it. So I always want to make sure you're right on the center line when you're in between yeah. planes like this and watching your wings. Watching both wings, especially it's hard in the sun. Yeah. Okay. Line of traffic, RV three and seven Victor Alpha taxi and runway three two Molino. Stupid sun, go away. Alright, clear right, clear left. Go ahead and hit continue there, you gotta get through all, right, all this stuff minute. before the uh What are you doing? Trying to get it uh it's at the right level. Okay, well we'll get turn this. Oh. Okay. We've talked about that, right? Yes. Okay, so just turn it, just 3050. Okay. Okay, we're good there. All right. Everything's good with the green. All right, I'll come to a stop and give you the controls. All right. And you will make a call and let them know we're going to be making left closed traffic. Okay, your controls? My controls. Controls. Milano, this is RV317 Victor Alpha. Uh, taking runway 32, making left closed traffic. Milano traffic. No, we're not taking anything. We uh, are departing. Departing. Runway 32, making left closed traffic. All right. All right. All right, let's get his tracking straight on the center line. Make sure the nose wheel's nice and straight. And just hold that right rudder in there and let it up as needed. Okay, there you go, just start right there. That's it, right rudder, right rudder. Right rudder. And there it is. Accelerate, no, no, take it easy. Accelerate and then climb out 75. What did I do wrong there? Well, you get up in ground effect and you try to make it fly a little bit faster than it's ready. So you, that's why we that's why we don't want to bring the nose wheel up too high. We just want it up just so it's off the ground, just to protect it. That's all. And then it makes you accelerate to at least 60 before you climb out because anything under 60 is really just going to be flying in ground effect. As soon as you leave ground effect, you're going to lose yeah. all of that lift that you have uh, and you're going to fall back down. So. Your hand on your throttle. Okay, turn crosswind. Make your crosswind call. Milano traffic, 317 Victor Alpha, crosswind, runway 32, Milano. Left crosswind. Left, Left crosswind, 32, Milano. You gotta say the direction. Okay, go ahead and continue your downwind. Uh, 45, 7, 3, 0, is... 
traffic pattern height is 13. Make your downwind call. The line on traffic, 317 Victor Alpha, left downwind, 32, the line on traffic. There you go, good, that's it. Okay, power back. All right, so jump ship one is departing 3-2, which means I they're going to have there. jumpers here in about oh, okay. 10 minutes. So you need to be aware of that. Okay. Okay, downwind. So, I have bugs. Yes. Switches, seatbelts. I'm already on, so I don't make a, I don't make a second call here. Okay. But what's on the beam? We're going to pull point. power. Yep, we're right there. If it's under the wing, then we're beaming. Pitch 70. Pitch 70. Pitch 70. There we go. And flaps. Jump ship one. How many canopies do you guys have? Somebody calling jump ship one. Yeah, just wondering how many canopies you have on board. Okay, thanks. We'll keep an eye out. All right, so 10 to 12 shoots is what we're going to be looking out for. Okay. Uh, Lino traffic through and 7 Victor Alpha on base. Uh, runway through to a close left. Lino. Yeah, just I'm slow down. Take that. a breath. Yep. Take a mental breath. Okay? You know what to say. Just take yeah. a mental breath and just say it. Okay. And okay. Next, I pull flaps pitching for 65. Five hundred. Okay, I'm pitching for sixty. Milano traffic through one seven Victor Alpha. Final three two uh, Milano traffic. Okay, good. I do avoid saying runway three two there. You can say runway three two. All right, 60, come on. 60. Airspeed, runway. 60, not 55. 60, get that nose down, add power. Come on, add power. You're going for the trees. Come on, go around. Okay, go around. around. Pitch up. Pops up, half. All right, rudder right in there. Pitch up. There you go. Line of traffic, 7 Victor Alpha going around 3 2, Milano. So you're getting slow, and you were getting low into those trees, and yeah. you weren't doing anything to fix it. It's okay to make those mistakes, right? Yeah. But you gotta fix it, and you yeah. can't just wait for it to happen. How to do it. Alright, going to train your crosswind. Make your crosswind call. Milano 3, wind 7, Victor Alpha, crosswind, left 3, 2, close traffic, Milano. Left, cross it. My controls for a second. My controls. Okay, take a breath. A physical breath and a mental breath. You're doing a great job, so you just need to keep doing what you're doing, but you need to slow down, relax a bit. Because it's when you get, uh, you know, too much too much going on in your head yeah. that you start just kind of falling apart for no reason. Like, there's, this is a perfectly calm day. There's no other traffic around. You've got yeah. all the time in the world. You are just like rushing, rushing yeah. yourself, okay? So, left downwind, left crosswind, left base, okay? That's what we say. Milano traffic, RV317 Victor Alpha, left crosswind, 3 2 Milano. 3 2, okay. Okay, go to make a downwind call. Milano traffic, 317 Victor Alpha, left, left, to, left crosswind, left downwind, left downwind on 3 2 Milano traffic. Okay, good. I'm going to fly for a second. I just want you to make radio calls, okay? Okay. All right, we're at BMR point. Power's coming out. You want me to do the 70. worst part of this? I want you to do the part that you need practice on. Yes. Okay, I'm pitching and trimming for 70. Okay. There's 66. All right, I'm in the white arc. Oh, I had full flaps down this whole time. That was both of our faults. I went the wrong way and didn't confirm okay, it. Okay, half flaps. Okay, 65 on base. Go make base call. Milano traffic, 317 Victor Alpha, 
Base, left runway, 3-2, and Milano traffic. Left base, just put left first. Left base, 3-2, Milano. Two. Left base, 3-2, Milano. There's no left runway. And this would be final, 3-2. Yep, 500. no left on this one. Okay, I like it. Pitch to trim. Pitch uh, for 60 now. Turning final. I'll bring in full flaps here in just a second, but look at I'm pitch, I'm, I'm trimmed for this. Yeah. I'm not having to do anything. It's just flying itself to the runway. Okay. A little bit fast, so I'll trim for 60 here, but I'm gonna be putting in a flap, so I'll be ready for that. Okay, there's full flaps. Now I'm pitching and trimming for 60. Okay, and then I'm just using power to make sure I stay above these trees and maintain the airspeed I want. Make a final call. Milano traffic through Ben 7 Victor Alpha, final 3-2, Milano. Good, that's it, okay. I'm a little fast, so I'm going to take some power out, pitch up, so I maintain 60, because I want to set it down on this second strike. So power is to idle right now, power is to idle, I'm getting down, and then I'm leveling off, and I'm just flying it to the second stripe right here. And I set it down right on the third stripe. <laughs> okay, okay. holding that nose up, not letting it really slime down, okay. Flaps coming up. Power coming in, right rudder. Rotate. So look it. Got that That's why we hold that nose down. Yeah. So we accelerate and not climb out too too quickly. Yeah. Uh, before it gets out of ground effect. Okay. Okay. Your controls. My controls. Your controls. And on the throttle. And on the throttle. That's right. Just gotta adjust on the rudder there. Alright. Bumper 75. There's 75. Alright, going to turn crossway and make a crossway call. Milano traffic, 317 Vector Alpha. Crosswind left 32. Milano traffic. Traffic calling on McMinnville, you're on the wrong frequency. Okay, make your downwind call, level off. Oh, we're just about over the junkyard. Pull my power at that. Okay. The line of traffic, 317 Victor Alpha, downwind. Left downwind. Oh, left downwind. 3-2, Milano traffic. No, left downwind. Not, not downwind left traffic. Oh, left downwind. Yeah. And say it right now, left downwind. Left downwind. Three say it again, downwind. left downwind. Left downwind. What's next? Left base. Okay, perfect left base. Okay, okay we're being on spot. There. There. Pitches. Okay, and I'm at the end, so... Now we're pitching to 70. The white, so I'm going to add half laps. Okay. White R70. Yes. Pitch and trim for 70. Pitch for 70. Come on. And trim. Most important. There it is. Okay. okay, go into trim base. You don't want to get too far out here. Yep. Yeah. Right, left rudder. Okay, make your base call. Milano traffic, Ruben 7, Victor Alpha, left base, 3-2, Milano. There you go. D! Yeah. He can be taught! Yeah. Turn up traffic, Cessna 45720, turn hey. left base. 65. We're number two for the runway. 65. 65. Okay. Start, start heading towards the numbers a little bit. We want to... Okay. Stay close enough to where if we lost our engine right now, we'd make the runway. Uh, yeah. And we win it at this point. So, yeah. pitch for 60. Pitch for 60. There you go. And pitch for 60. I didn't say add power. I said pitch for 60. You have enough extra airspeed right now that you don't need power. You just okay. have to pitch for the right I, airspeed. I thought I needed so, it, but yeah. So pull that back okay. and just pitch for 60. There you go. There's 60. There's hold 60. back. Okay. But now hold 60. Yep. You've got plenty of airspeed right okay. now and, and plenty of altitude to okay. hold 60. Okay, no more flaps yet. Don't do any flaps. 60, yeah, come on, 60. 60. Okay, now There's a little 60, power. Feels low. Yep. Just a little power, but just a little. That's it, still hold 60. Okay. Good. 60, 60. There you go. 
Good, holding 60. Bringing it down, 60. 60. Nose down, 60. Nose down, 60. Add some power. There you go. Now just level off and power to idle. Okay, you're, you're about 10 feet in the air. Yeah, there you I go. Way too high. There you go. There we right go. Down. Just fly it level. Just fly it level. There you go. Okay, keep the center line. Down Good. Flaps okay. up. Flaps up. Confirm. Okay. Okay. Hold that center line. Full power. Hold the center line. Come on. Oh, Stop. Fuck. My controls. My Your controls. controls. That demon again that's just trying to pull you off the left side of the runway yes. for no reason. Yeah. Two minutes traffic, 7 Victor Alpha is on the departure leg 3 2. We're making left close traffic and uh, we'll uh, make a full stop on this one and let those jumpers land. Malino. Crosswind, just make our call. Molino traffic, 7 Victor Alpha, left crosswind, 3 2 Molino. Okay, hey, now you're going to make the downwind call here when we get there. Yes. Alright, go ahead and make the downwind call. Molino traffic, 317 Victor Alpha, left crosswind, oh. left downwind, 3 2 Molino. There you go. All right, we're coming up to our altitude. On the downwind. All right, take a breath. You ready? Yep. Okay, your controls. My controls. Your controls. Earth bottle. Four five seven two zero is clear. Okay, brakes. Undercarriage. Gas. Switches. Seatbelts. Way too high. Oh, oh beam your point. point. Power oh. early. Yep. Pitch for 70. Flaps half. Here we are. Trim that out. On 70. There we go. Power out. Power out. Need to get down. So, no need for power right now. All right. Pitch for 70, start turning base. Make your base call. Milano traffic, 7 Vector Alpha, left base, 3-2, Milano. There you go, good. Left base, yeah, pitch yeah, for 70. That. Okay. This is a good distance now. from the base, so we don't need to be, we don't want to be pushed further. Yeah. So this is good, just keep it coming down to 70. Yep. 70. All right. Okay, because we're still high, so we can still okay. pitch for 70. Okay, you can even go full flaps now. Okay, full flaps. Trim it out. Okay, now pitch for 60. Okay, 60. Nice and slow. Oh, yeah. Going to make a final call. Milano traffic, 317 Victor Alpha, final 32, Milano. Good. All right, pitching for 60, right down to the it's numbers. Yeah. Power at idle. We don't need any power at idle, yeah. Okay. Are you trimmed for 60 right now? I... No, you're not. No. I can tell you that right now. <laughs> and I'm really high. Yes, you are. That's fine, just hold okay. 60. It'll start coming down if you hold the proper airspeed. Okay. It's when you don't hold the proper airspeed that it doesn't do what gotcha. you want. Okay. Just hold this. Yeah. It's coming right down. There you go. Kind of feel the sight picture there. Yep, you don't need any power. You're just going to okay. bring it down. Then you're going to round out to level okay. flight. Round okay. Out. Get us over there. You're too high. Let it come down nice and easy, nice and easy, nice and easy. There you go. There you go. Good. That's it. Now get us back on the center line because uh, you're landing on runway 30 right now. Yes. And there is no runway 30 here. Get us right. off here. We're going to do a taxi back. Take all the way back. There you go. Good, get us over the line and then clean up the airplane. Good, nice. Okay, that was a really nice okay. touchdown, right? Yeah. Okay, there's that. Flaps. There we go. Uh, All right, my controls. 
Milano traffic three one seven Victor Alpha clear three two Milano. All right, we're gonna look for uh, the jumpers here. We're gonna head back to Twin Oaks. Hopefully, here they right. are above us. Oh yeah. I don't see any strays. They all seem to be on this side. Yeah, they all land all back here. But they stay on the they stay on that side of the runway. Yeah. That's why all the pattern, the pattern is on that side. Yeah. All right, so that was, that was nice. You weren't in line with the runway, though, right? You yeah. were going sideways. So yeah. just need to make sure you're just tracking straight on the runway. Yeah. But the touchdown was nice. Yeah. Round out was a little bit high, which you fixed nicely, yes. right? You let it down, and you touched down nicely. Um, so we just need to continue to work on really getting a good sense of where that round out needs to occur so that you yeah. don't need to let it down, right? You should yeah. just round out right two feet over the runway one foot over the runway and just fly at level from there. It, it felt a lot better to be higher. It felt weird as we were coming in, but it felt a lot more coordinated than Yeah, I mean, ideally we want trees. a proper glide slope of yeah. about three degrees, ideally. Yeah. Uh, but, um, you know, it doesn't hurt to have a little extra altitude when you have an approach like this with all these trees. Yeah. Certainly better to be higher than low in that uh, situation. But, uh, yeah. It was nice. I see no traffic. Okay, so we'll wait till everybody lands here just to be safe. Line on traffic. One minute, parachutes over the field again. Oh, wow, okay. Did not everybody get out the first time? That's weird. <laughs> There's one person up there, I see. All right. Well, we're going to depart, and we're going to depart back to Twin Oaks, so I'll make a call here. Yeah. I'm line of traffic. RV2 and 7 Victor Alpha is going to be departing 3-2, making a departure to the uh, northwest, and uh, we got the uh, jumpers in sight. Malino. All right. My controls. Your controls. rudder as I come yeah. in here. No, just hold that center line. Okay. Close up right there. Just hold it there. Don't let it go back. Uh, just hold yeah. it there. It'll fly when it's ready now. Yeah. Okay. Now I'll pitch it up. There now you go. Okay. That was better. That was better. Yep. Make your crosswind call this time. You're going to say left crosswind 3 2 departing to the west. Last call, Molino. Okay. Molino traffic, parachutes over the field. Molino traffic, 317 Victor Alpha. Left crosswind departing to the west. Final call, Molino. All right, so we'll make sure that we don't uh, go through. Aurora's airspace, so we're going to stay to the north of Aurora's okay. airspace, so be sure to navigate yourself enough to, you got it here, you got it. Cessna 45720 is turning left uh, base for runway 02. There. My airspeed is fast. So you see, you need to turn to the right so you don't go into Aurora. Oh, I see that, okay. Just a little bit, though. Um, well, you need to go oh, up no, and around. Oh, okay. Way. Hey, yep, climb it. VY, come on. Twin Oaks traffic, Cessna 45720 is turning final. For we'll just go up to 2,500. 2.5, okay, I'll bug that in a minute. Choosing this heading, just uh, 
works. Pitch 75. Altimeter 3052. Visual approach, runway 35 in use. Parachute jumping activity over Milano and Malala. Caution bird activity on and in the vicinity of the airport. Hazardous weather for Oregon and 5G notams in effect for Aurora State Airport. For further information, contact flight service frequencies. Advise on initial contact to have X-ray. All right, X-ray. All right, so you're going to call up the tower. You're going to say Aurora Tower, RV-317 Victor Alpha, um, RV-317 Victor Alpha is uh, four miles west, sorry, four miles east, request to transit the airspace direct Twin Oaks with X, it was X-ray, right? Yes, X-ray. Okay. With X-ray. Aurora Tower, 317 Victor Alpha. Four miles east. Four miles to the to east. Uh, looking to transit the airspace to go west with a information X-ray. Tower, heavy helicopter, five hotel Tango, I-5, request, uh, or just confirm midfield crossing eastbound. All right, Sound Victor Alpha, affirmative midfield crossing, uh, your discretion, and then landing at uh, HTS at your own risk. Five Hotel Tango, thanks, sir. All right, three on seven, Victor Alpha, Aurora Tower, safe position. Say four miles uh, northeast. Three on seven, Victor Alpha, four miles northeast. 2,500. 2,500. All right, three on seven, Victor Alpha, Aurora Tower, uh, transition is approved, altimeter 3052. Just say 3052. Seven, 3052. Seven, Victor Alpha. Three on seven, Victor Alpha. Okay, good. So now we have permission to go through the airspace so you can go direct Twin Oaks now. Okay. Oh, it's the Canby Ferry underneath us. Yep. You can go direct Twin Oaks, so are you going to uh, You're right. Do that. Said that. So I'm going to does not have a reason, unfortunately. Okay, altitude is good. Twin Oaks is there. Activate. Okay, there you go. Okay. Good, good, good. So then you can, uh, it's already switched, so that's fine. You don't want to uh, switch frequencies until we're either clear of their airspace or they give us frequency change approved. Yeah. But uh, once we do, you'll switch over to Twin Oaks and you'll make the initial call. Oh, yeah. What will our initial call sound like? Uh, Twin Oaks, 317 Victor, RB-317 Victor Alpha, 10 miles east. miles east inbound. Uh, what I say? <laughs> From there, what do I want? runway that you're intending to use? Uh, so inbound, runway zero 02. Yep, that's it. What okay. else? You just want to give everybody the most amount of information that you can yeah. without being over too much information, right? If if you wanted to see the uh, windsock uh, and overfly, what would you what would you say? Just overflying? Overflying at seventeen hundred, yeah. 
I mean, we're going to overfly at 1700 anyway, yeah. but yeah. To say you're over the field at uh, 1700 or if you were a thousand feet over. But I, I meant this first call where it's like, I don't know what I'm doing except for I'm coming yeah, in. You just, you're just coming. You just want to know, hey, we're coming. That's it. Then it gets more detailed as you get closer and closer. More detailed and more numerous, right? Yeah. About 10 miles, then 5 miles, then basically at that point. So in the, in the 5 mile call, you'll let them know what your intended uh, method of entry is. Right? We're going to overfly the field. Uh, okay. Then the next call you make is when you are executing the intended method of entry. So over top of the field, 1700, right teardrop, left down. Uh, and then from there, it's just downwind, base, final. All right, we're clear of their airspace, so you can switch over to Twin Oaks now and make that initial call. Okay, they won't say goodbye or anything? No, we're okay. good. Uh, yeah, okay. Oh. There you go. Listening for a sec. Twin Oaks traffic, Cessna 45720, taking off runway 02 and joining the pattern, Twin Oaks. Twin Oaks, RV 317, Victor Alpha, eight miles to the east. Overflying the runway for zero two, Twin Oaks. So you kind of mix two calls there because yeah. you're you're eight miles to the east, so you're not overflying the runway. You can't be doing both at the same time, yeah. right? So eight miles to the east, inbound zero two should have been your okay. call. Just let them know, hey, we're coming. When we get five miles here, you'll say we'll overfly the runway one uh, seventeen hundred uh -huh. for the right teardrop entry zero two. Traffic off our left, 500 feet below us. Uh, they should push back here. Okay. What direction? Toward us. Shouldn't be a factor, but yeah, they're behind us now. Okay. Okay, so you probably want to start your descent, right? Yeah. Down to 1700. They were seven miles out. Okay. So I'm pitched for this, so I'm just gonna stay at it. Feel that rudder. There we go. Pull back, 3,500. Just pull it back. Okay. You're being two. Yeah. Just two. Two. <laughs> I don't know. But just pull it back. All right? I'm not being enough. Yeah. yeah. Uh, bug your altitude, 1,700, so you don't go past it. Okay, and another mile, I'll make the call. We're five miles east, overflying at 17, 1,700. Tear, teardrop, right. Yeah, into so just 12 traffic, over here in San Victor Alpha, five miles east. Gonna overfly the field, 1,700, right teardrop, entry, two, uh, zero two. Twin Oaks. Okay. You can go ahead and make that call now. Yeah. Twin Oaks, RV 317, Victor Alpha, five miles east. Uh, making uh, overflying runway at 1,700 to make teardrop entry to the right uh, for left downwind zero two uh, t Twin Oaks. Yep, there you go. Yeah. I'm through it, but I made sure to say everything that I wanted. Yep, that's the important thing. It's okay if you miss something, but get back on and fix it. Yeah, you know. Okay, we got 200 to go. Oh, there's the runway. So I'm actually going to go left a little bit. Okay. Starting to recognize the, the buildings more. Good. That's and important. I see, I see the white blob there of the nursery. Twin Oaks traffic, Cessna 45720 is turning left uh, base for runway 02. Twin Oaks. so I can kind of guess where he is. Well, you shouldn't have to guess if his radio call was correct. Yeah. That's the idea of radio calls. So you know where people are, you don't have yeah. to guess. <laughs> I, I meant, I, I'm looking to see if he's there. Yes. 
Okay, you know the area to look for him in. Yeah. Cessna 45720, turning final for runway 02 at 20. Altitude. Going on the slow side anyway, so. That rudder in there. Oh, yeah. There we are. Want to make sure we kind of cross over their midfield, right? All right, good. This is a good time to do your initial pre-landing checklist, right? Make sure that everything is where it needs to be. Yeah. You want to start getting it's, your mind in the landing yeah, mindset. And not be rushed yep. later. So check my brakes. My undercarriage, as far as I know, is still there. Is clear of active taxiing back to runway 02. Gas. Yes. 123 is there. And then switches. Uh, impulse. Okay. okay. And I lost altitude as I was doing that. Yep, so fix it. Get back up there. Okay, I see that creek, so I can kind of guess that I'm overflying. Okay, so make a call now that yeah. you're over top field. Twin Oaks traffic, overflying uh, uh, runway uh, 317 Victor Alpha, making the right teardrop for the left zero to uh, Twin Oaks. Left downwind. All right, you can start a descent from here, okay. but keep straight until we're up in the nursery. Okay. Yeah, so the way that radio call should sound is just Twin Oaks traffic, RV3 and San Victor Alpha, over top of the field, 1700, making a right teardrop entry to left downwind, 02, Twin Oaks. Okay, yeah, and I didn't even get the, the elevation in there. Okay, I'm going to 1200, at 14 now. Make sure you bug your altitude, otherwise you'll go right through it. Going to make your downwind call now. Twin Oaks RV 317 Victor Alpha entering downwind or left 02 Twin Oaks. What is left 02? Left 02? Oh. You said left 02. There is no such thing as left 02. Left. Left downwind. Left downwind for runway 02 uh, Twin Oaks. There you go. Okay, altitude. Five seven two zero is taking off runway zero two twin oaks. Okay, now we're past okay. our point, we're so past it. starts so descending now. Descending, and I am in my white safe zone. Wait, that doesn't sound good either. Yeah. Oh, and I got full flaps. That was wrong. There we go. Pitching for seventy. Do you high or low? 
I am high. So why do you have any power in there at all right now? Yes. Okay. Make your base call. Twin Oak 317 Victor Alpha, base for left, uh, uh, left runway 32, uh, Twin Oaks. Oh. 7 Victor Alpha, left base at 0 2, Twin Oaks. Thank you. Just uh, take, a, oh, take, take a breath. Yeah. Before you talk, even if you're holding the mic down, just take a breath, say, okay. <laughs> left base, yeah. 0 2, Twin Oaks. Yeah. One full flaps, I am really, really high. Trying to decide. Yeah, I'm definitely going around. Okay, so adding some power. I go my flaps. You go around. You go around. Okay. Okay. We're not. We're not making up our mind. We are getting away okay. from the ground. Okay. Flaps up. Seven up traffic. Seven Victor Alpha going around. To zero two. We have seven two zero in sight. We'll follow them around. Okay. Pitch for VY. I must back up. Okay, go around is not a, oh, I'm going to think about it, and I'm just going to okay. ease it in. Go around is a go around. I need to get away from the ground right now. It doesn't matter how close to the ground you are. Okay. You get away from the ground. Full power, pitch for VY. Okay. Okay, hold on a second. You see them? Off of our wing, you see them? Uh, oh, okay. okay. I hadn't seen them. All right, now turn crosswind. Okay. And level off. Okay, there's a lot going on. We're in the traffic pattern. This is the highest yeah. workload of flying, right? That's where we are right now. We're also at the end of a very long flight, and your brain is in overload, yes. right? But this is no different than what it's going to be at any time. Yes. When you're a pilot, and whether I'm here, whether anybody else is here or not. So yeah. you need to re uh, reel yourself in right now. Get yeah. your head where it needs to be and do what needs to be done. So you're 100 feet high, you're turning downwind, you have that traffic there, you need to make a downwind call. Twin Oaks, RV 317 Victor Alpha, turning downwind, uh, have traffic in sight. Twin Oaks. I didn't say downwind for what? Yes, zero two, number two. Okay, so I go back slow and down. say that or just no, that's fine, okay. just keep an eye. Okay. I see him. Okay. He's so, a lot higher than I want to be, or a lot further out than I want to be. Exactly, so slow down. Yeah. Power back. You should be flying at 70 right now okay. in level flight. Don't descend yet. He's yeah. way out there. Okay, pitching for that. Okay, maintain altitude. Okay, there we go. This is the workload that comes with flying. You've got yeah. to manage it in your head. You've got to manage everything. You've got to manage yeah. traffic, airspeed, altitude, radios. Yeah. It all happens at once, and that's just the way it is. Look yeah. at your airspeed slow. You're going to stall if you keep letting it get slow. Pitch for 70. So it's all about cross-checking yeah. and going from one thing to another. So traffic, airspeed, altitude, radio. He's past me so I can turn. Okay. And I am and turning start descent, on start base. Descent. Okay. Twin Oaks traffic, 317 Vector Alpha, turning base, number 2402, Twin Oaks. Good. The only thing that should have been better there is the left base. Okay, left but everything base. else was good. Okay, you showed situational awareness. Are you high or low? I am high. Okay, so take that power out. One. Okay, and I'm going half flaps. Okay, trimming. I'm pitching for 65 right now. Okay. And turn. There's 65. I actually like that now. I'm waiting on flaps for a sec. So, I like this, but should I go flaps and a little bit of power? 500. Oh, if you need to, yeah. I mean, full flaps is a standard... Yeah. Uh, for landing, so just go full flaps in there. All right. And then pitch for Flaps, 60. Pitch 60. Make sure you're trimmed for 60. But you're on a good glide slope right now, yeah. so as long as this holds, you don't need to do anything. But as soon as you yeah. start seeing yourself go below the glide slope, add a little bit of power. But you're looking yeah. at your airspeed. 55, 56, oh. get that nose down, pitch for 60. Yeah. Okay, add some power. There you go. Make a call that we're on final. 
Twin Oaks, 317 Victor Alpha on final 402, Twin Oaks. Okay, 60, not 64, 60. Okay, I like this height Not though. 58, 60, add power. Okay. Let Smooth it come down. on the controls. 55. Okay, keep us over there. Good job. Center line, center okay, line, keep us over there. Now get on the brakes a little bit. You can get us off at this high speed yep. taxiway. All right, just keep going. Don't just keep rolling. Just keep okay. rolling. If you think ahead enough, you can just slow us down and get us off there. But yeah. that's fine. Go to the last one here. Okay, stick back. You're good on power. You don't need more power. Okay. Pull it back. Slow us down, slow us down, slow us down. Okay, get us off here. All right, good. My controls. Your controls. My controls. No traffic, 7 Victor Alpha, clear 02, taxi to parking, 2 Oaks. All right, your controls. My controls. Your controls shut her right. down. Clean up the flaps yep. first. Okay. The numbers. Trim at a reasonable seven, spot. Uh, 45720, taking okay. off runway 02. Turn up. Okay, got him. All right, guys, thanks for hanging out with us today. Hope you uh, enjoyed that. Learned to something, perhaps. Uh, Ted did a great job. We're going to go debrief. And uh, we'll see you next time. Say bye. Say goodbye. Bye. Bye. Okay, ELT confirm off. Avionics going off.